بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد الدعاء كما قال النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم الدعاء هو عبادة the supplication is worship so we should supplicate often meaning that we're worshiping Allah often and we're asking him subhanahu wa ta'ala to accept our good and to fulfill our needs subhanahu wa ta'ala and supplication a supplication that I like which is very simple I hear the scholars mention this all the time yeah, it's very simple and it contains immense meaning though it's very beautiful when you think about it and what they what often you'll find in many lectures from the ulama is they'll say class with the bat and I always try to say that in my lectures and talks and short sittings or what have you is that we ask Allah nasal Allah al-ikhlas sincerity with thabat and firmness and when we look at the meaning it's very powerful a very powerful supplication because by asking for ikhlas these are the two things in which our deeds are accepted by Allah is sincerity to Allah that whatever you do is done for the sake of Allah as an act of worship to Him, Subhana, and that you do it in accordance with the Sunnah of the Messenger of Allah, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, and that's that Thabat, Thabat al Sunnah, Thabat al Minhaj, the prophetic methodology for doing things, the Minhaj of the Salaf of this Ummah. You know, how did the Sahaba understand? So when you're asking that simple, simple supplication, you're asking Allah, you're asking Him to keep you firm on Tawheed in the worship of Him and Him alone. And that you're asking Him to keep you firm on the Sunnah and away from any and all forms of Bidah and Shirk, Wazanbaqa, and those things which go against the prophetic methodology. And that's powerful. That's incredibly powerful. Because that is the success. If that simple supplication is answered by your Lord subhanahu wa ta'ala, that alone is sufficient. Because if you're being sincere and worshiping only Allah, meaning staying away from shirk, and you're also being firm on the sunnah, what other success is there? We ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil. Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alayhi wa sallam.